Tap this app, date 26, 19th of March 2023. Today, dear brothers and sisters, the Lord is asking us to open our eyes. Open our eyes and look at Him. He wants to heal our blindness. He wants to heal us today. Because in the Gospel of today, in the Sunday, we see Jesus Christ healing the born blind. The born blind was healed out of his blindness, but the Pharisees and Sadducees who were behind that blind man to inquire how he was healed on a Sabbath, they are not worried about their own fellow person who is able to see now after years because he was born blind. They are worried about how can someone work a miracle on a Sunday, on a Sabbath day, according to them. So today the Lord is asking us to open our eyes and look at him. The first reading of today we see how Samuel goes to the house of Jesse and his eyes is closed. According to him who is worthy to be a king, someone who is good in personality. So all the seven uh, kids of Jesse, they were good in personality and he did not find anyone uh, chosen by God among those seven. So he was wondering, Lord, if not the seven, who? Then comes a small puny little boy and the Lord says, don't look at his appearance, anoint him as the king. So many a times we are blinded by appearances, we are blinded by the external things. The Lord is asking us to open our eyes today and see. The second reading of today also speaks about awake, O sleeper, arise from the dead and Christ's light will shine upon you because we are children of light. Two things necessary for us to see. First is light, another is sight. If there is light and no sight, I can't see. If there is sight and no light, I can't see. So I need light, I need sight. Light is Christ. If I am in His presence, I have the light always. But I also need sight and sight is faith. Faith I see in the light of Christ. So may the light of Christ and the sight of faith be with you. May your eyes always be open. Today, a small trick for you, a small tip. Go to a room, dark room, switch off the lights and experience the darkness. And then come out and tell to your soul, if Christ's light is not present in me, this is how my soul is. So I need Christ, I need His light. Amen.